A Deputy Prime Minister Hing Sui Kiet says dialogue on issues like Section 377A must be done in a way that moves society forward. He says reaching a so-called new equilibrium on the subject will show that there is room for accommodation, even on such contentious issues. A new balance would not be possible if people insist only on pushing across their views or venture into polemics. Singaporeans, by and large, cherish a harmony and common space that we have. Even for difficult and emotive issues, parties have approached dialogue with respect, restraint and rationality. Mr Heng was speaking at a book launch based on a series of policy lectures by Singapore's central bank chief last July. Ravi Menon had outlined alternative concepts such as raising wealth taxes and studying having a minimum wage. Mr Heng said such a plurality of views should be encouraged as it adds to policy formulation. But he cautioned that there's still a need to find common ground or risk facing a gridlock. While we want a diversity of views and debate the different perspectives rigorously, we also need leaders with a vision and courage to decide on a course of action. And once a decision is taken, it's time to act collectively and decisively with all hands on deck. And we must periodically review the choices made to see whether we could do even better.